Good afternoon, everyone. Welcome back to the channel. I am Brian. Thanks for tuning in for a new video. This is a very special collaboration video. This is the After Fab Collab 2.0. We were there with uh, Mina Villegas Art, Sarah Mack Art, Cause Creations, and Waterfall Acrylics. And also there were special guest artists as well, Molly and Eric Hughes and Michelle Galley. Uh, I am going on the first day, which is Saturday, right before me was Cause, Cause Creations, Kathleen. And right after me is a newer artist, Lori. So I will have a playlist in the description below. You can hit that playlist and that will take you to everyone's videos in the order that they are going in. So I have a very limited time, so let's get down on the canvas. Okay, so what I'm working with today is a 24 by 24 gallery wrap canvas. And I have got a tape to push pinned on the back. I have painted my edges and sides with one of my colors, which is my Amsterdam and the turquoise blue. I got my inspiration, not only obviously from Mina doing a big canvas class, but I also got some inspiration from this colored sock. <laughs> I wanted to go bright colors. And so this sock of mine, I was like, I'm gonna try to pick these colors. So that's what I did. So real quick, I'll run through these uh, colors because I don't have a whole lot of time. So we got Amsterdam black, oxide black, greenish blue. Again, the turquoise blue, 24 karat gold from Deco Art. I've got titanium white mixed with the satin enamels from Deco Art. And I've added some black to it to create a gray color wonderful and beautiful so i didn't want to go with just straight white i'm also using the amsterdam in the um, azo yellow deep and then i'm using two pebio colors i'm using a lot of colors in this too iridescent orange yellow and i'm using fluorescent pink and the fluorescent pink i added a little bit of black and a little orange because i wanted to tone it down all my paints are mixed with Liquitex Gloss Medium, Floetrol, and water. All right, so for this size canvas, I'm gonna need about 24 ounces of paint. So I've got an HDX cup, for a one quart cup from a Home Depot. It's got markings on it. So 20 ounces is right there. So we'll probably go up to about 24, just so I have got a little bit of extra. Uh, I think today what I'm gonna start off with is a little bit of this off-white or excuse me, the gray, not much. A little bit of black next to this gray color. The greenish blue. Some gold. Turquoise. Put in some more of the gray. Gonna come in with the yellow. This orange. And the pink. That's gonna be an interesting combo, I can tell you that much. Gonna put the black next to that pink. Let's come in here again. I think we got enough in there. That's well enough paint. Let's put a little bit of... Uh... That's some 
yellow. Okay. All right, I'm gonna pour into a little bit of the gray here instead of gold. Now normally with the uh, straight pours, a lot of times I will pour up really high, but this time I'm not. I'm gonna pour down starting low and I'm gonna stay low. Wonderful color palette. Wow. Beautiful. Alright, let's open this puppy up. Thank you. 
right. All right, I'm gonna leave it right here. I'm gonna clean up the edges. I'm gonna to torch and then I'll bring you guys in. This is really great. The satin enamels is really starting to cloud up, giving me some wonderful cells through here. The lines, this section here with this bright pink and orange and yellow, just great. I love this so much, guys. Let me, uh, I'll clean up my edges, I'll torch, and then I'm gonna bring you guys in. Okay, here is the wet result. It is still selling up. This uh, satin enamels is really kicking in. It's starting to cloud up into some of the cells the longer it sits. Just loving it. Let me start you up here in the top left. Here's the dried result, really beautiful. Let me bring you in here. All right, that's gonna do it for today's video. This dried amazing. I'm loving the outline of this red through here. It's really giving me like fire and flames, underworld tones. Um, just happy with it. Really dried great. I'm gonna put a coat of gloss varnish on this and get this up ready to sell. So that's it. So I wanna say thank you so much for everyone putting this together at Brita. You did an amazing job organizing this. Thank you so much. So next we're gonna head over to Lori's channel. Again, the link is in the bottom of the, uh, in the description portion of this video. You can just hit that link and that'll take you to everyone's videos. Thank you for watching. Thank you so much. This was a great, great time over in Delray Beach. Thank you so much for inviting me and Mina. I was very happy to be able to be your uh, assistant. So. All right, everyone, I'll see you next time. Have a great day. Bye-bye.